Today, we're going to show you the disassembly process of the 100 odd and tell you why who like batteries are safe and reliable. Preparation before disassembly. Before removing the battery, make sure you are in a well-ventilated area. Then check the battery for any visible damage. We're going to use a multimeter to check the battery status. The multimeter currently shows that the battery's voltage is 13.37V. Start the battery disassembly. We can see the battery terminals here. Battery cover removal. Let's start the disassembly. This is the battery's extra flexible 6-gauge silicone wire, which can withstand up to 200 degrees Celsius. BMS We can see the BMS inside. Here we used a dual cooling design. The 100A battery is made up of four 3.2V 100A cells connected in series and 0.3 mm thick cellulose paper, which is used as insulation between the cells. Metal Fixture We previously mentioned that the battery cells feature 1 mm thick metal end plates on their sides. So why are additional fixtures necessary? Beyond aiding in heat dissipation due to their steel composition, the fixtures play a crucial role in preventing cell expansion. Without them, the cells may undergo irreversible swelling. Variations in the state of charge SOC, can cause different degrees of swelling, and this deformation is permanent. Swollen cells can compromise the safety valve, potentially leading to safety hazards. By installing fixtures, we can effectively prevent cell swelling, which, if left unaddressed, could reduce the battery's lifespan by up to 30%. Moreover, lithium battery fixtures keep the battery safe during storage and transport. By reducing vibrations, preventing leaks, and absorbing impacts, making transit much safer and more stable. Waterproof Test We conducted a basic waterproof test on the battery. Even when fully submerged in water, the battery continued to power the light. This battery is rated IP67, where the 6 signifies complete protection against dust ingress and the 7 indicates resistance to water immersion up to 1 meter for a duration of 30 minutes. We have now completed the battery disassembly. Thank you for joining us.